it. YouTube family, the Maverick in the space again. My mommy said, best and most credible opinion, fear and fearless analysis, and it now goes stop. You know, somebody talk about a topic today where I know some of the viewers and some of the people who comment on the channel now go like. Because I did text, say, you have some people where it's not just on the channel, just some people generally, them don't like news when they're favorable. You understand? So, if a news no nice and give a feel good thing about it, them don't like hear them news there. But as a newsman, by and large, me can't afford to discriminate against news that way. News are just news and news are information. And you have to use the news and the information as it is. All right, now me I make an observation. We're in the Olympic year. Paris 2024 is on the horizon. And generally speaking, the Jamaican athlete them have struggled. Outside of Sherika Jackson and probably Brianna Liston, who had a little tweak and a recover now, me understand. But generally speaking, when you look on the sprint of them, male and female, we say Ansel Parchment the other day. We say Rowan Watson, we say Akeem Blake, we say Oblique Civil. We say most of them already, you know. And the Jamaican athlete them, them now sparkle. Them now inspire a lot of confidence. Them look like they must struggle. I mean, I wonder if something is fundamentally wrong with the Jamaican program. I mean, it's not a singular program, you know. You have different athletes are, are trained at different jurisdictions. But even in the generation next, we are come show. The girl that we get so ex excited about. We see Alana Reed. We don't know if Alana Reed are burned down the place. We don't see Kevona Davis. We don't hear, we don't see Ashanti Moore. The Clayton Twins. Serena Cole. Where's Serena Cole then? Brianna Williams. The Jamaican athlete, them look like they must struggle. Generally. As we say, you have the odd one, you know. But me don't know, me just, me just get a sense, say, eh, the Jamaican athlete, them must struggle going into the Olympics. And me get a text from a prominent track and field coach the other day. He actually said it to me first, you know. And then me in a discussion, totally unconnected person. And the person also said the exact same words to me. Say, my African noticed that the Jamaican athlete them are a struggle, generally speaking. And I true. Outside of Sharika, as we say, where she run a good time in her first, first 100 meter. She win a 200 meter already. She look okay. Not that she a blow you away, you know, but she look okay. But generally speaking, see, Akin Bloomfield retire. They may have it say Nathan Allen retired to apparently that is not true. We see some of the quarter mile of them. We see Antonio Watson. The other day I run up at the invitational. The athlete them look like they must struggle. We see the quarter mile hurdler. Um Hyde. The other day look like he must struggle. Russian Clark did not the same race. Finish better than Hyde, but still we're not getting enough wow moments from the athletes. Going into these Olympics, and is a cause for concern. No, strategically, you know, may I make that video ya almost on the eve of the race and strap meet. And you know what my hope is? See, a lot of the athletes, the Jamaican athletes, are going to compete at the race as Grand Prix. I'm going to come there and stamp them class and put on some marquee performances so that we can walk back the video and say, yes. That one they look ready, that one they look ready, that one they look ready. Britain and this way did come back from injury the other day. Anybody? I mean, she competed earlier in the season, but how good Britney and this look? We see Hans run a race. Daniel Williams run a race. And when she finished. Me, me but I just can't remember any impressive looking Jamaican athletes. Since the season has start. Outside of Brianna Liston and what she had up on the collegiate circuit. And of course, the consistent Sherika Jackson. But the ones outside are probably two or three athletes. The athletes, they must struggle. Julian Ford look good as well. You know, him come back and look like him in some good form this season. But generally speaking, we don't know. And as we say, going into the Olympic Games now, 
you won't get a buzz about how the athlete them look and the kind of farm with them in a, and your expectations kind of rise. But I'm not sure if we are being inspired with the more one about four weeks from trials. Is that enough time for people who have not been competing and have not been impressive? To come and made all of them fences and turn the tables and look impressive? Is it about timing? Peaking at the right time? So it don't necessarily for your peak now four weeks before trials and another quite a number of weeks before the Olympics. So they must save them peak for right going into the Olympics. Could that be the theory? Remember last year, Shelly and Fraser Price never start our season, you know, until almost the end of July, you know. Because you don't know it was World Championship and she never need to qualify. But me don't know, me worried people. Me start get worried. And when me see like people like coaches are reach out to me and I acknowledge the same thing and I say, Jamaican athletes generally are struggling. We don't know. As Mr. Ray says this weekend, me walk me around. But right now, I don't feel me wrong. When you look on it dispassionately and objectively. Put it this way. More of the Jamaican athletes look underwhelming than those who look overwhelming. I don't think any of them look overwhelming. Except, for, again, for probably Brianna Liston. I remember Brianna Liston is far, her season is far from done, you know. Because she have only more competition for go through on the collegiate circuit. And she's an injury prone athlete, and anything can happen. But we have to call her speed as speed. She looks really good. She looks imperious. And there's lots of expectations that she's going to make some of them flat event team there. But outside of Brianna, listen, people. Nobody has to really look good. Talk to me good now. If you want to go feel events, I'll look for the feel events one day. Shanika Ricketts. She didn't finish second the other day. Um, Dakers. I mean, I no, no, we're not getting any war moments, early season moments from the Jamaican athletes. Facts are facts. YouTube family, tell me if we leave out anybody out of the equation. Is there anybody who is performing impressively on the circuit? In, every, in any event, you know, track event or field event, any athlete out the Jamaican a perform at a level imperious, impressive. That me not mention. I me a forget. I me a overlook. Our fellows cast a broad brush over them. Said the Jamaican athlete them. The athlete, Jamaican athlete them must struggle. Based on what me say, the Jamaican athlete them must struggle. Tell me what you think about the Maverick team. Yeah man. Full for thought. I me a step way. The Maverick has stepped with, see me a step with it. Do the right thing, you know. Do the right thing, but we are stepping right now. At least they don't look impressive. Me are worried. They don't look good. Maverick has stepped with, my God. Me are stepping with.